And you know by now, this is where we play a piece of one of my sermons, and it's going to bless you, every one of you. Now, here's the word of the day. For the time will come where people will not endure the soundness of doctrine, the strength of teaching, the sobriety of living. But after their own lusts, after their own desires, they will go find teachers that will approve what they want to do. They will go find ministries that will say what they want said and will condone what you're doing. That won't interfere with their sin cycle. Hallelujah. They will go find preachers that will scratch their itching ears and they shall turn away their ears from the truth and be turned unto fables or lies or people preaching stuff that ain't God or pe people getting up preaching because they had a vision or people getting up and preaching because they heard a voice say every vision and every voice got to go through the Bible the Bible is the filter the Bible is the test of whether it's you or whether it's God because if you hear something in a dream if you hear something in a vision and it doesn't correlate with the Bible, then that's a lie. Because God's not giving any new revelations. I said God's not giving any new revelations. There's nobody waking up today and saying, oh, God's changed the plan. And he said this. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. The Bible said, Paul said, if anybody comes to you, if we ourselves come to you preaching anything than the gospel that you've already received, if an angel comes down and preaches to you another gospel, that, let that angel, let that person be a curse.